Robert was afraid because he thought that Drogo would be bringing too many men to defend against and some lords of wavering loyalty might join the Targaryen cause when Viserys and Dany arrived with the Horde. His reign was very unstable, especially with Rin gone and his wife's family tightening control over the government. Robert is also at this point a shell of the man he had been, with pretty much no stomach left for fighting or really even much in the way of bravery. He had once been a formidable warrior, but had let himself go to pot. The reputation of the Dothraki has been gone over dozens of times, we know they're fearsome. No point on hashing that out again. Hey guys, welcome to my channel, please don't forget to like and subscribe and also click on the notification bell to remain updated. I think though that Robert's fear is misplaced. Namely, I think that the Dothraki invasion was set up by design to fail. I don't think the point of it was ever for V-Series and Donny to succeed in toppling Robert. Look at how many men Robert expects versus the number we know Drogo actually has. Drogo initially offers V-Series only 10k men. Even if he brings his whole horde with him, that's still only 40k, and not all of those men will survive a sea crossing successfully or even make it to shore, with Westeros coastal defenses. Robert is almost certainly getting his intelligence from Varys. So why is Varys, if he's on Team Targaryen, highballing the number to Robert? Why wouldn't he tell Robert to expect fewer men, if he actually wanted an invasion to succeed? Robert's forces would be meeting fewer men than what they were expecting, and that's assuming that every one of the 10k slash 40k would make it to land, which wouldn't happen. Not to mention that the small folk and lesser lords and knights aren't going to be feeling very receptive to V Ciris and Dani when there are Dothraki pillaging through their lands. So the Dothraki invasion was meant to speed up Robert's demise, in a way, but not in the way you'd initially think. Thanks for watching, please don't forget to like this video and drop comments, and most importantly don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you don't miss anything.